Hi there and welcome. In this video, I want to show you how you can promote your show by creating a Facebook banner and loading it up on your personal profile. The reason why I suggest that is because your personal profile has all your friends, has your associates and people that want to be looking after your stuff. They are friends with you on Facebook for a reason. Now there is a strategy that you can work on to increase the people that are friends with you on your Facebook and that is looking at the friends portion and we'll do a separate video on that. And it's important that you try and increase your friends on Facebook as much as possible because your posts, if we journey together, I'll teach you about consistency and the more you post, the more people will see your things, the more your friends will increase and the more attention you'll have on everything you do. But we'll go back to that in another video. Right now, we want to focus on creating a banner for your Facebook profile so that you can promote your show. Remember, people are going to come to your, uh, your Facebook profile regularly, often, and um, that is one way to promote it. First, I want you to go to a website called Canva dot com secondly you could go and do the following search um, free uh, royalty free images now there's two parts to this number one we need to have a proper um, we need to have a decent image to use in our banner now I like this platform Unsplash you can go as you can see I've used a lot of different platforms to go and, get, go and get things that I want to look for. Now, I am looking for a, a, an image that represents radio, and that's what I'm going to use. Now, your show might be about redemption, it might be about healing, it might be about missions, and so I encourage you to go and look for an appropriate image that, has, that represents your show. I am going to look at uh, internet radio remember go to any site where you can get free royalty free images and you can download them for free now if you have a stock image account that's wonderful and obviously you can go and use that but i'm somewhere going to use a free uh, royalty free platform i'm just looking through the images here to find an image that best communicates what i want to do all right, I like this one. So I'm clicking on it to open it up and now I'm going to download it. All right, so while that's downloading, I'm going to Canva. I've already downloaded the image, so I'm not going to do that. You can go to Canva and you click log in with Facebook. I'm assuming that you have a Facebook account. Otherwise, you can log in with Google or you can create an account uh, with your email address. Now here at the top, you can search for different designs that are already existing. Now my search is going to be for a Facebook banner. And so I'm scrolling through this and I think I like this one. Because my image is also black, I think this design is going to be the best fit. Right. Now you can see there's an image in the background, but it's not quite what represents my, uh, my show, my look, my platform, my brand. And so I'm going to go and um, search for the image I just downloaded. And going to upload it to Canva. Once, you, once it's read, finished uploading, you can go click on it and it's going to bring the image into your feed. Now what we want to do is we want to make it nice and big so it fills the whole space. And now you can see that it has basically filled the whole image. So the writing is close. Um, what it's done is it has now moved it to the back, which is wonderful. 
Now, if that hasn't happened, what you can do is you can go and change it up and uh, there should be a tab here that says positioning and just move it to the back. Now, you can see that already, this is a pre-designed image. It looks great. It has the radio um, kind of uh, the pop filter and the mic right there. And so all I'm going to do is I'm going to change this to my show name and it's going to be uh, ministry media space show right and if you see it goes bigger like this then just spread the spacing out here all right and I fix that I'm gonna put a hashtag in front because that's how my show is branded okay um, you'll see there's red there, so we can just go and say, um, add the dictionary. Okay. Now, here at the bottom is what we call a tagline. Now, in this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how to um, change it. I'm going to use that, and I'm going to use my tagline. Your message to the world. Right. And that is it. I'm happy with that. Now, if you move, need to move this around somewhere else, you can just go and ungroup here and it will separate the two. Now, I'm happy with that. Now, what I want to do is I've got this preloaded. I just want to go and um, look for some icons. What I current, this is what I currently have. Um, all right, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm maybe going to put in a, um, I'm going to copy that. Let's duplicate that. Let's click on here and press Ctrl D. And duplicate it and in this case I'm going to ungroup it I'm going to delete the top there and I'm going to use that I'm going to write here um, Mondays 12 p.m. Uh, Central African time all right that's when my show airs so I'm gonna make this nice and tight and because this uh, Because there's a lot of black here, I'm going to put it there so it stands out. All right. And um, I think maybe we can add the station name um, at um, Rainbow Gospel Radio. Okay, I'm just going to move it a little bit so it stands out nicely. Okay, and now the question is, where is Rainbow Gospel Radio? I'm going to search, I'm taking a chance here. the Rainbow World app. And so I think what's going to be easier if I just um, use the Play, Play Store icon here. Right? And you're looking for the transparent one because you don't want it to take out, um, go over your image. 
So I'll use this one and I'm going to download the image, so save image as. Right, and so I'm going to go back to my design and I'm going to duplicate this. I'm going to move it to the top here. And I can say, uh, I'm just going to call it Rainbow World. And the reason I'm doing that is because the user, the people that are currently using, um, using Facebook, they are on their phones already. And so if I give them directions, they can just go and download it. So I'm going to upload the icon for um, the Play Store quickly. Therefore, we're going to click this in, we're going to make it smaller, we're going to move it to this side, make it nice and small. It's just the icon, it shows you that, listen, um, this is the App Store, and you go search for Rainbow World. So it's, it's nice and clean, you can see everything probably. All right, there's a lot of text, which is also not ideal, maybe um, we can make the text here a little bit smaller so we'll choose 12 uh, we'll clean it we'll bring it closer and just move it around so you can see it nicely you see the nice black background you can see it clearly uh, ministry media show message to the world and if you look at my previous design um, there's that right there's the mic uh facebook live is there i'm not currently doing facebook live because of the lockdown uh and then the the website but this and if you can do this as well it will help with the community this will help that people will go download the app and listen to us there and obviously more downloads there are the more um, we can have next step is to go and um Choose JPEG and then you download the image. Okay. Now I'm going to go back to my Facebook page and then I go update cover photo. I'll say upload photo and um, I'm going to go look for my image that I made. There it is. And it's going to upload it. And there is my brand new image. Now, there's a problem here. I'm, I don't know if you can see it. Let me give you a second. Can you see the problem? The problem is the details of the show is there. And that's where the icon is. So we'll have to go back. I think putting it here is, looks great. And so I'm concerned a little bit about this. But... It should be fine. Um, let's download that and see what it looks like. Close. Let's go back to Facebook. Um, say cancel. And I'm going to say update again. Okay, and upload the photo, and there it is. So you can see nice, clear uh, name of the show, that way you can get it, and what time. And that is how you do it. So you click, just click Save Changes. And what's also nice is by you updating your banner it will also have posted it in your timeline and people can see it and um, they can also get aware of that so very nice and that is how you create and upload a brand new banner to promote your show thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in the next tutorial